So system defined metadata is data that only Amazon can control, but that's not technically 100% true because there are some values you can set. Uh, the first being content type, but most of these you do not set. Uh, they're set internally by AWS. Let's take a look at the system defined metadata. We have a uh, content type. So it tells you the type of file it is. Cache control, you know, how long it should be cached for. Content disp uh, disposition. This is if you want to change the name when you download it. Um, but again, you don't have much control over uh, this one, at least here. Content encoding. So, you know, is it a compressed file? It's language. Uh, when it expires, uh, whether it needs to redirect. I assume that is probably something for static website hosting. So yeah, exactly. Um, you don't uh, change most of these values. And there could be other ones here that aren't listed, but these are the ones that I was able to find. AWS will attach some system to find metadata even if you do not specify them. So if when you upload a file, it's going to already attach them. If you want additional ones that are not being returned with the object, then you specify them. Some system defined metadata can be modified, such as the content type. I've mentioned this like three times now. So just understand that generally you do not modify system uh, defined metadata, but there are a few edge cases.